everyone, Montez here, playing Super Mario Galaxy. In the last episode, we finished Beach Bowl Galaxy, with all of its stars. So now we're going to do Bubble Breeze, Boy Base, and the one that's outside, Drip Drop Galaxy. So first we're going to do Bubble Breeze. Shouldn't be really hard, because I finished it over five times in my previous files. Through the poison swamp! So, it's gonna be really straightforward. Starship, the Starshroom may crash. This is a poisonous swamp. If you fall in there, you're done for. Watch, your, watch yourself in the poisonous swamp. Just an example. Sure is strong here, eh? Don't you think it would be awesome if we could wi ride that wind? Ironically, we will. Oh, or is that ironically? I'd say it's more convenient. Now, let's see if this happens. If we... Yep, if we throw a star bit at it, it will explode. Kinda helpful, I guess. I don't want to fall in. Ow, I think I broke my bubble bone. Ah! Hey, before you write any bubbles, let yours truly feel bored. Lend your ear for a sec. Bend your ear, not lend. You can move around in your bubble like holding down A. But do it while you're... Target is blowing on the bubble. If you go too far to one side, use the target to blow on the other side. Alright. And A is... B is... The B button is disabled. Sure, you could just ground pound out of it with Z or just touching it like that. Don't believe me? Just hit Z. You should get out. Alright, what now? Hey, I forgot to tell you something. So if you get into a bubble and you want to get back to the surface, just press Z to get down. Oh yeah, and if we get pinched between moving obstacles, that big bubble's gonna burst. So watch out. That beady voice. Oh, so how is there two fill boards?
Only south, a shortcut. I better know what my directions are. Ha! Huh. Okay, here we go. of this is worth it. Interesting thing here. For this one, you do not want to do the goal. Instead, you want to do something else. And yes, you're gonna have to go underwater. Bloody fortress. We call it the boy base. But nobody's using it now, so we're just here for upkeep. Welcome to boy base. Guess what will happen if we blew <laughs> that blew up that underwater way? Come on, guess. Give up. That tower in the middle of the water would float right up to the surface. Oh, so yes, there's bloopers in this game.
so don't fall down. Oh goodness. Oh! Worst part, you can't get back up from that way. So if you need air, you're gonna have to go this way. Oh God! I get held back. That also took seven minutes. Why am I up here? You rescued a gr oh, that's why you rescued a green power star. These stars have a special power. That's the green loom is about them. After all, they will transform into green power stars to someday. I was about to say today. Uh, yeah. So this is the first time. For the first time in Okay, I'm not gonna do it. So let's see if he's saying anything new. He is definitely saying something new. Thank, thank you for helping me. I am a guardian of the trial galaxies. To restore the doorway, we will need the power of two others like me. Is that it? Okay, that was worth listening. I guess so. Oh, what, even when she's kidnapped, the princess is so thoughtful. Well, come see me next time if there's a mail delivery. I shall. Alright. Now. 
now we're gonna do the original. I'll fucking skip these two. Turn them off.
All right. So seven minutes. to go to the Drip Drop Galaxy? Yas! Okay, then. Giant Eel Outbreak. terrorizing the waters lately. Can you help us? Grandpa's getting old. Green girls like those could gobble us all up in one bite. Can you beat those green girls by hitting them with shells? Ever since those big eels showed up, we haven't caught any fish. Get rid of those big eels! I don't think it's just the eels, I think it's also the nukes that you have in water!
now he's dead. Okay, never mind. Not again, not again, not again, not again, not again, not again. Puff of fish. Not again. Are you kidding me? That comes from underground? Got him, did I not? Our little friend. Ah, oh, to be young again. Yowza! That's work! Let's go get some fish! Now you can catch fish! I still don't think you should fish in this water. I mean, look at all the bombs, all the stuff that's in the water. I think you should go fish somewhere else. That's my opinion, though. Yes, I got another star! <laughs> another star! <laughs> Star bits, etc. Ah. 
Ah, oh, dang it. Oh, no way, that was the first level. It was the first level. Dang it, too high. Okay, should have used one of those coins. Oh god. I thought I 
all crazy in there. Try to save me sooner t next time, bro. Yeah, yeah, you want this power star, right? Only if you tell Rosalina I found this one. Yeah. Yeah, because it's green. The power star is mine! Whatever, Luigi, whatever. Under the saucer. Somebody get a plate, somebody get spaghetti. Oh, she made lots of spaghetti. References. So, uh. We're detecting massive energy spikes. What are they doing there? It's time to unlock everything. Boom. Bam. Bop. Bada bop bop. Darkness on the horizon. Mario. Mario. Non-silent.
it's time for a fight! dead. Wow. Not bad. I guess I chose the right guy to be my arch enemy. At least you always put up a fight. But it's too bad for you, because my master plan is almost complete. Tough luck, Mario. Bye bye You got a grand star, as usual. That's long. All right. Mom. Yeah, a certain the location of your special one. Please look at the circle by your feet. We need 15 stars left. That number represents the power stars you need to reach the center of the universe. And actually, now thinking about it, to get to the center of the universe as the final boss. And in order to get to the final boss, you need 60 stars in total. That number will decrease with each power star you recover. And when it reaches zero, the Comet Observatory will regain full power and fly as a starship block again. And then we'll be able to reach the center of the universe. Oddly enough, <laughs> in this one file, I just had I just needed one more star and able to get to the final boss. It was so hilarious.
and it's the most easiest stage. Ooh. So we're gonna read, as usual. Let, Let us begin. begin. Chapter five, home. The kitchen will go here, and the library will go over there, the girl said busily to herself. We'll put the gate here. Ever since the girl took Luma under her care, she had been bustling <laughs> at a about at a feverish pace. It's a lot of work, but it's worth it to make a happy home. It turned out that starbits weren't the only thing buried in the ice. There were tools and furniture unlike any they had ever seen, and the girl used some to build a home. Looking at the completed house, Luma re remarked, Don't you think it's awfully big for just the two of us? With a library, bedroom, and kitchen, fount and fountain, and gates, it was certainly spacious, but still, something seemed to be missing. If only my father, brother, and mother were here, the girl said wistfully. Indeed, the house was too large for its two small residents. That night, clutching to her favorite stuffed bunny close to her heart, the girl fell asleep in the starship. Mm. That should do it for today. So now we have five chapters. So guys, that is gonna be the uh, end of this episode. Wow. I had to look at the time for a quick sec. Meh. Wow. Uh, if you guys enjoyed this episode, uh, please like, comment, and uh, subscribe. And uh, thanks for watching. Uh, have a good one. Uh, bye. Hopefully you knew who I was trying to copy.